I'm here at Makassan Airport Rail Link Station. I was up before the crack of dawn this morning at 5 a.m. and then I took the MRT, which is the subway metro system here in Bangkok, Thailand, at 5.39 a.m. to Pechaburi Station, which cost me 42 Thai baht. And then I made a short walk to Makassan Airport Rail Link Station and I'm headed to Sawanapum Airport, which cost me 35 Thai baht. Very excited to be back at Sawanapum Airport for the first time in a very long time and traveling again. Keep watching to see where I'm traveling to next. Here at Sawanapum International Airport, I'm flying on Vietjet Air to Chiang Mai. I gotta go through security and get to my gate. 7.03 right now and the flight departs at 7.40. Looks like a lot of the shops here at Sawanapum are under renovation. Going through a little shopping area now. Royal Project. Lawson Station convenience store. Look at this, they even sell beer here. Look at that. Plane. Walking away from Chiang Mai International Airport. Try to find cheaper transport than the overpriced taxi that they're charging 100 150 Thai baht for. There's Doi Sutep in the distance. The top of it is covered with clouds. Walking past Chiang Mai Immigration. Drive through 90 days, Chiang Mai Immigration. Now I am walking past Central Airport Plaza. It's 
not open yet. Looks like they got everything in here though. There's the Starbucks. Silver Temple. Wat Sri Sapan. Let's check it out. art gallery Wow look at that Amazing The detail on it Silver Wow. The goat over there. This is locked up. Let's go take a look over here at the pagoda. Oh, a lot of pigeons making a wind this is a little bit gruesome he's eating a person the signage within this temple compound is the best I've seen in Thailand English, Thai and this is the Japanese Soldiers Memorial. Muon San Temple was a hospital during the Second World War. And many Japanese soldiers were treated here. And they have a ceremony here on August 15th of every year. Statue of the Great Monk Sri Wishai. Look at the detail on this work. Unbelievable. Now they have safes. And you make a donation, it goes right into the safe. It's pretty good. Wow. I have entered the old part of Chiang Mai. Walking to my favorite restaurant in Chiang Mai, I'd say. Wat Chedi Luang. Vera Wihan. 
Look at that. Look at this wood temple. Very cool. Wat Pasan Tu. Wat Pan Hill. Look at this temple. It's completely made of wood. It's unbelievable craftsmanship. Looks like they're renovating the Buddha image. Got a sign up there. I'm walking through this famous gate in Chiang Mai, the Tapa Gate. You may remember this from a previous video that I made about the Loi Kratong Festival and the Lantern Festival here in Chiang Mai. And it looked much different then. Look at all these closed businesses. Got my favorite northern Thai dish, khao soy with chicken. This is yellow rice noodles, dry noodles, vegetables, and chicken in a coconut cream broth. I've come to this restaurant many times. The lady is very nice that runs the place. Unfortunately, she passed away and her son and his girlfriend had took over. So let's try it out. Good crispy noodles. Get some lime in there. And also give you these condiments. that we have here as condiments. Wet chilies, dry chilies, crushed chilies and vinegar, whole chilies and vinegar. This is the outside of an excellent cow soy restaurant here in Chiang Mai. Local style. I'll leave a link in the description below where you can find it when you're in Chiang Mai. Look at this great street art here. This is normally a very busy street with tourists and home to the Chiang Mai night market which is currently not running 
not because it's not night, but because there's no tourists here. And that market was primarily geared towards tourists. Here is the governor's residence. I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment in the comment section below, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you're notified when I post future videos. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.